This is the story about how I got banned from our local pizza delivery place. We decided we'd like a pizza for tea one night, and I was nominated to place the call to order a 12-inch deep pan vegetarian pizza with garlic bread and a bottle of pop. Unfortunately, they were out of 12-inch bases, so the pizza dude offered me two 6-inch pizzas for the same price. Now that sounds reasonable, doesn't it? Well, actually, I didn't think so. You see, the 6-inch and the 12-inch refer to the diameters of the pizzas, so the 12-inch pizza is twice as long in each direction as a 6-inch pizza. So twice as long and twice as wide, it's got four times the area. OK, the formula for the area of a circle is pi times the radius squared. The radius of a 6-inch pizza is 3 inches, that's half its diameter, so its area is pi times 3 squared, which is about 28.3 square inches. The radius of a 12-inch pizza is 6 inches, so its area is pi times 6 squared, which is about 113.1 square inches. Try it on your calculator now. The 12-inch pizza has got 4 times the area of the 6-inch pizza. I should ask for 4 6-inch pizzas for the price of one 12-inch then. What do you reckon? Well, the thing is, the 12-inch pizza was also twice as deep as the 6-inch pizza. So twice as long, twice as wide, and twice as deep makes 2 times 2 times 2. That's 8 times the volume. So I asked for 8 6-inch pizzas for the price of one 12-inch pizza. Then he tried offering me 3 4-inch pizzas. But that was an even worse deal. The width of a 12-inch pizza is 3 times that of a 4-inch. The length is 3 times and the depth is 3 times. So the volume of a 12-inch pizza is 3 times 3 times 3. That's 27 times as big as a 4-inch pizza. I'd need 27 of them to get the same amount of pizza. But Pizza Dude wasn't having any of it. And I tried to give him a short maths lesson to prove I was right. But it didn't go well. In the end, his manager explained to me that he had my name and number and he knew where I lived and I would not be bothering them again, making ridiculous demands and upsetting their staff. But I was right. So, if you want to buy pizza without any stress or worry, you need to forget the following information about length, area and volume scale factors of similar shapes whose dimensions are all in the same proportions, like small or large pizzas. If the lengths are twice as big, then the area will be four times as big and the volume will be eight times as big. If the lengths are three times as big, then the area will be nine times as big and the volume will be 27 times as big. In short, the area scale factor is the square of the length scale factor and the volume scale factor is the cube of the length scale factor. Why not visit nagwa.com to find out more?